Good morning and happy Wednesday. I just got back from a three mile run with my mom. It's getting better, it's getting easier. Um, didn't take a camera or anything, even my phone with me because it was kind of raining when we started. But now I'm home, I'm gonna make a green smoothie to replenish myself with. So one very ripe banana, got a cup of strawberries, a handful, a heaping handful of spinach, and then some water. Little notes left around the house are my favorite thing. I think they're super sweet. And so I came into the bathroom to wash my face before I sat down because I was like, I need to do this. My little post note for Michael. Good job running this morning, Bugs. Credit. And then I am all fresh and ready for the day. Well, not completely fresh, just my face. The rest of me is a mess. And I'm going to plan out my day in my bullet journal. So usually what this looks like, some weeks I would completely fill out my journal, my bullet journal, but like sometimes I just do Monday, Tuesday on Monday. I'll do Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday now. So it starts off looking like this. And this is what it looks like after. I was gonna make oatmeal but I'm really craving a veggie burger. So we have like a chickpea scramble thing that I made yesterday. There's some beets under there. Ooh, chip the burger. Veggie patty, avocado, sriracha. Yes. I am done editing yesterday's vlog. I'm getting faster and faster and faster at it. Also, I should probably get ready for the day, but not doing it, not doing it yet. I'm resolving my ad revenue or AdSense account or whatever you want to call it for FemLife. I had an email waiting for me this morning and they're like, it's simple. It looks like you've had, you know, blah, 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 exactly what I knew I did. And then they're like, which one of your two AdSense accounts do you want to use? So that's getting resolved. So thank you YouTube for being on top of it and responding and thank you. I just ordered one of these Thunderbolt um, ethernet connectors because I have a ethernet cord that we ran. I don't know if you can, can you see that? Can you see that cord that is running from the ceiling? That runs down through my closet and then below all my dirty laundry. It's this, only this can't plug into my, my laptop. So I need a, a adapter. And we legit ran it all the way through the ceiling. And it comes out over here runs across the freaking floor behind the couch to all this mess. And I want that fast connection power in this back bedroom. You know, I want it. I've just finished taking all of the text from Dish the Pill off of the PDF and putting it into like a pages Word document. I'm doing this because I'm holding by text. I put it into like a pages Word document on my computer so I can edit it and like tweak it from there rather than on Canva. Oh, so now I need to, it's about noon. I'm gonna go run some external hard drives, external hard drives over to Michael because he needs them. So I've really got a hankering for those chocolate peanut butter protein balls that I made for the Quad Cities race. And all I need is like walnuts or almond flour, one of the two to make them. I got the rest of the ingredients. So I think I'm gonna go get one of those two things. And fun fact, when I studied abroad in Thailand, when I was like, 19 I think it was I got hit by a car like not bad not like hit I got hit to the point where I like got knocked over but not I think I was like a little bit bruised and there may have been a little bit of blood but it wasn't that bad but the only thing that came of it is like whenever I start like running more frequently I call it my tiny it acts up and it's this knee right here and it is like right over here right here hurts when I run and like after that. So now it hurts like going up and down stairs. Got my few groceries and I'm ready to go make some protein balls. So I almost find it annoying that when you're trying to shop with your own grocery bags, it's like people have never seen it before. I brought this tote bag and then I have this like produce bag. So I had those two and I like, had like five items and I set the bags on top of the items and she like took the first item and put it in a plastic bag. I was like, oh, I don't need bags. I have my own bags. And she's like, you sure? No, no bags for anything? I was like, I have my own bags. 
just hand me my items and I'll put them in there. Like I said, it's a lot nicer than that, but I'm like, I put my bag, like my bags on top of my groceries. How did you not see that? <laughs> but it's okay, you just kind of have to remind people sometime. So today I want to share with you how I'm going to make these. I used walnuts, just like whole walnuts last time, but I'm gonna use almond flour this time because walnuts at that store are a touch expensive. Three fourths cup of peanut butter plus two tablespoons. A fourth of a cup of maple syrup, two teaspoons of water, one teaspoon of vanilla extract, two thirds cup of almond flour, three tablespoons of cocoa powder, six tablespoons of chocolate chips. Mix this all up. Plug it in first. Pretty well mixed up. And then take these and make balls out of them. So now I'm gonna work on editing Ditch the Pill and I'm gonna eat some cherries and some protein balls. Yes. I feel like cooking too. That's right, I legit had to put this in here because I kept dropping cherries in my lap and I'm staining my clothes. Right now I am creating the email template for my Ditch the Pill course. It finally just clicked that I'm gonna have to make 32 individual emails for this course. What? I'm on lesson 13 of 30 of creating the emails. It's actually going a lot quicker than I thought. 10 left. Five left. Done, 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 done. Well, I'm not completely done. I've got it all in email format. I'm so excited about that. Even the welcome email, even the thank you email. That is 32 emails that I just busted out. I don't know how long it took me, but I did it. <laughs> Next, I want to work on researching an online store for Fem Head Merch. Can I just say that I'm very grateful for my like quote unquote online friends or just like the online community, I suppose. So many times, like, I can be like, hey, does anyone have any advice about this particular thing? And I will get emails from people saying, like, I do it this way or like, this is the answer you're looking for. And I don't know, people I have never met or you know, may never meet, may never know, you never know. But we help each other out and I absolutely love that. So thank you to everyone that has ever helped me out and ever will help me out. I very much so appreciate it. It is after five now. I think I'm gonna call it for a little bit on work. Call it long enough to make cauliflower wings. In here we have half a cup of flour, half a cup of water, like a teaspoon of garlic powder and half a teaspoon of salt. Then you want to take your cauliflower and put it in there. Normally I get a cauliflower head, but they didn't have that at the store, so. And then you want to toss this all together till it's all evenly coated. And then just go ahead and realize that you didn't cut up the cauliflower pieces. You're supposed to cut them into bite-sized pieces, so do that before you toss them, but now I'm gonna chop them up and put them back in the bowl. Mm -hmm. 